Hey friend, how are you today? I hope you're having a great day so far. Today's video is a quick little review on this little cutie. So this is from Lug and this is their trolley. I have the trolley in the color plaid gray. So I got this from QVC. On the QVC website, there are like 28 or 29 colors. So lots of colors. There are some solids and lots of prints. So let's go over the trolley case really quickly. First of all, it's like a, a nylon material, so it can wipe clean really easily. All of the hardware on this one, so I can't attest to the other prints or colors, but the hardware on this one is like a um, gunmetal color. That's also the color of the hardware on my wallet that I just reviewed not too long ago. So that might be across all of their their patterns and prints. I'm not positive about that. But this has so much organization in this little thing and I really do like it for traveling. I haven't taken anything out of here. So what you're gonna see here is the way I've had it packed for my last trip. This is the front here and as you can see, there's a zipper here and then there's a zipper at the top. There's one on this side, one on this side and then on the back, there's another one. Also, there is a little Velcro, so it will fit like down on your suitcase if you want it to do that. And there's a handle, which is nice. The bottom does have little feet. It's like plastic down here, so you can wipe it off if you sit it like in water or something, I'm guessing, and the feet are like kind of a hard plastic as well. This is what it looks like. You can organize it a little better than I have. I just kind of threw stuff in here because I don't necessarily care. As long as everything will fit in whatever I'm putting it in, I don't really care if things are standing up nicely or whatever. It doesn't, it doesn't really matter to me because usually by the time I get to my destination, <laughs> everything's fallen anyway, so it's not a big deal to me. As you can see here, the inside is plastic, I guess and you can wipe that clean, so that's really nice. So if anything spills, you can just wipe it clean. There is a zipper on the very back here, so that zips, and you actually don't, you kinda don't know that it's there in a way, because, okay, so that's plastic there, right? But when you open it, it goes into there where there's this material. So it's kind, I wouldn't say a hidden zipper, but if you're, you know, just kind of opening, you don't really notice that it's there. The top part is this mesh material here. So in here, I just have a bunch of like wipes and things like that. Clorox wipe here. I've got some little samples of like stuff for my face. And this is the receipt actually from um, QVC from when I bought it. I don't know why I have it in there. I'm not returning it. So down in this main compartment I just have just stuff okay I've got <laughs> hair stuff I've got moisturizer this here is like a mask really should go in here I've just got just random stuff in here okay but it does fit a lot all right I'm gonna give you dimensions in just a minute I really do like the side pockets here so in here I put hair stuff so I've got some little clips down in there. Also have the tag for this bag. And yep, it's the top trolley in the plaid gray. On the other side, I have one Brett. <laughs> so that's all I have in there. I've got one Brett. And you can see the cute lining there, which that's not the uh, plastic lining that's wipeable, but I think it's still probably wipeable because it's that nylon material that you can easily wipe off. If you see me messing with my hair, it's because I just did a review on it and it's not wanting to stay out of my face. Let's look at this front pocket. So it just zips around like that and it kind of just, it has a gusset. So it just pulls out like that, which I actually like because, you know, if you have a pocket that falls all the way down, your stuff is going to fall out of it. So I like that it does that. I don't use this much. I just have some little cotton balls and cotton pads in there and it is divided which is pretty cool so you know you can put whatever you want here and whatever you want here if you need to separate them like a comb would go in here i didn't point out that here on the front there's the little lug plate right there okay on the back 
you have another zip around like that. And this one does come down. But the thing with this one is there is an elastic, like two little part elastic there. So this to me would be the perfect place for jewelry. If you don't take a lot of jewelry with you when you go on a trip, this might be the perfect thing for you. Bracelets would fit in there. A necklace would fit in there. Rings, earrings would fit in here. And it's just, it's not a really tight elastic, but just enough to keep it closed like that. So, you know, when you have it zipped, it's really not going to go anywhere. There are actually three versions of this bag. So there's one that actually has a crossbody on it. I'm not sure if it's the same dimensions. I'll look in just a second. And then there's one that's a mini. So it's a little bit smaller, but it's the mini trolley. So this is the one that's right in the middle. It looks like the one with the crossbody is a little bit smaller, like this way. So this is 12 inches in width and the other one I believe is nine inches so everything else I think is about the same but it's just a little bit shorter that other one that's the crossbody that one's RFID protected I'm not sure if it has the same compartment layout that this one has because I think it's built more as a purse than as like a case that you would take for travel like I said the dimensions here are 12 inches in width five inches in height, four inches across in diameter. It's not a super expensive piece. It's about 40 something dollars. Let me look here. I'm looking down at QVC right now. It's $42, which isn't a huge investment. I mean, if you're gonna travel, if you're gonna use it, I think it's a good piece for you to get because it does give you compartments. And I think that that's really important when you're trying to pack for travel to have those compartments you know you have this here you have these things in here you have certain things down in the main compartment so i think it's a good one for travel i love it um, i've used it two two or three times for my travel since i've gotten it and i really do like it like i said if you don't you know if you're not keen on this pattern there are solids like black you can get one in black i believe you might be able to get one in this color this is like the blush Yes, there is one actually in this exact color, blush pink. So, you know, if you're not a patterned type of person, you could get a solid. When I purchased this, like almost all of the colors were sold out that I was interested in. And I really did like this one. And so I just went ahead and got this one. I'm not too picky as far as colorways when it comes to the things that I'm just putting in a suitcase anyway. I just took a chance on this one and it's worked out. I really do like it. So, if this is something that you think you might like, I'm linking it down for you. So, go ahead and check it out. Thank you so much for watching. If you have any questions about this, be sure and let me know. And I will answer it if I'm able to. Again, thanks for watching and have a great day. Bye.